Hey everybody, welcome back. Living in Community Day 8. So this is the start of our second week and uh, we are in the middle of Holy Week. Um, we've been walking through uh, the the days of, of Jesus getting ready for crucifixion and then Easter Sunday celebrating Jesus rising from the dead and completing the payment for our sins so that we can have a personal relationship with God. This is a, a, a super fun week for us to just kind of pause and reflect. And the gift of time that we've been given, especially to focus in on this week. Now, what's interesting about this day, um, Wednesday, is that the scholars don't really know uh, what Jesus was doing um, this day as, as you're looking at the scriptures. Uh, it's believed that, <coughs> excuse me, that Jesus rested, that he just stopped. We're not good at that. Right. As as uh, Christians, we are not great at taking a pause of taking rest. What we're we're doing, we're we're, we're doing stuff. We're, we're busy. We're busy, busy, busy all the time. I want you to ask, ask yourself this question. Where do you need rest right now in your life? Where where are you stressed right now? And maybe you're thinking about finances. Maybe you've lost your job. Maybe. Uh, there's a relationship that's stressing you out. People have expectations of you. Uh, your workload might be heavier. Um, you know, you, you come home and, and or you're not able to leave home and it's stressing you out and you just need some rest. What would that look like? Jesus says in, in Matthew chapter 11, he says, Come to me all who are burdened and I will give you rest. So as we think about Jesus and our relationship with him, where do you need rest? And today, take it. Take some rest. Now, rest, it not necessarily mean taking a nap or, you know, laying in a cot or, but it might be, I, I need rest from social media. It's stressing me out. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just stay off of it. Um, I need rest from thinking about all the stuff in my life. I, I need to go for a walk. For others, it might mean I literally need rest. I'm just going to go sit on a couch and, and just sit. Maybe you need to go outside and just look up at the sky and set a timer. So it's not because for some of you, the idea of rest is going to stress you out. Like, it, <laughs> like if I think about resting right now, it's going to cause anxiety in my life. Just think about setting a timer and go, you know what? For half an hour, I'm not going to do anything. I'm just going to pause. I'm going to hit the pause button in my life and I'm going to have some rest. And what would that look like? What would that feel like? What are the advantages of that? You might find you like it. You might find it necessary in your own life that, hey, I should do this on a regular basis because the truth is we all need rest in our life. So today on uh, Wednesday, the uh, middle of Holy Week, where do I need rest? And then take it. Give yourself permission today to take some rest and enjoy what God's given you. See you tomorrow.